Here, why don't you give it another try, huh? Angie! What are you doing in the tank? Covering for you. You said you were just going to the bathroom. That was half an hour ago. There was a long line. Churro. <laughs> you were so lucky I didn't get done. Sweetie, why don't you save that last ball? And then when Mr. Lopez comes, then... <laughs> That's all right. Just kill me. You'll be in Miami in two days. <laughs> Mr. Lopez. Yeah? I'm Dr. Stoller. I'm the principal here at Allendale. May I have a word with you? Of course you may. Mr. Lopez, I believe you know Lawrence Baxter. Did you make comments concerning this young man's weight? This young man right here? No. <laughs> there were witnesses, man. I was trying to get people in the booth. He took it the wrong way. Did you say he has the hardest working colon in high school? <laughs> Well, when you say it, it sounds kind of mean. Principal Stoller. Hi, how's the fundraiser going? She was standing right there. Ask her. Lawrence, chill. <laughs> Mrs. Lopez, did you hear the disparaging remarks your husband made about Lawrence? Well, no, I, I only heard him say, uh, good job, son. That'll help raise money for our handicapped friends. You know, did you know my husband was a, a volunteer firefighter? <laughs> It's too late, I just a grande chigo and ya me frego. What? He said the big cry baby screwed him. <laughs> I used to teach Spanish. Well, I'll just apologize to him. He's right there. I'm afraid it's too late for that. You see, we have a zero tolerance policy here for verbal abuse, and that applies to the parents as well. You need to write a letter of apology. We will publish it in the school paper. But until that time, I'm afraid you're going to have to leave the campus. So you're throwing me out? Honey, don't make a scene. Do you know how much money I made for this fundraiser? I bet if I was one of these rich parents, I bet if I donated a library or a science lab, I could do whatever I want, I could say whatever I want. Hey, Thurston, didn't you get the email? Stupid hat day is tomorrow. <laughs> Come on, Angie, stop. You're making a scene. Wrap yourself. Sit down.